it's Ant94 and for today's video we have three days left but what I want you to do is I want you to go onto the Crew 2 if you don't have this vehicle already because the Ford GT interception unit is available for you to get this week only so you have till the 4th of September but get it done by the 3rd and you'll be all good so off we go you got to do all you have to do to get it is get it into platinum do all the events get a good scoring system on it shouldn't be too hard right now there is 35 players that have ranked in it so you only have to get top 11 first on playstation i don't know what it is for the other ones but you basically that's what you have to do i'm going to drive the vehicle in this video so if you want to stay for that then leave a like Cuts to show that you enjoy this content and I'll keep posting more in the future. But this is this is a fairly long race, so if you want to leave and watch a different video, that's all good. But before you leave, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you're new, because we post the Crew 2 content mainly, well the Crew 2 and Motorfest. The Crew 2 not so much now, it's mainly Motorfest, but the Crew 2 does pop up sometimes, especially if there's a smart vehicle available, that is what I'm going to start doing, just so people don't miss out on what, what to get. So that's what we're doing. So you can you be able to unlock this car, which you can see now. Pretty cool. The police edition of the Ford GT. And you get to have it in a race on the crew. But the crew doesn't matter if you get it from Motorfest because the handling's going to be a lot different on the Motorfest than it is on the crew. Because the crew does feel a little floaty. But on Motorfest, it feels a lot more stable. So you're going to get that. I don't have this vehicle. That's why I'm doing the, I'm doing the summit anyway, because I need this vehicle as well. So hopefully you can all join in with me, get this vehicle, and everyone can be happy and unlock this vehicle because you know, on Motorfest getting vehicles, it's a lot more difficult than it is to get them on the Crew 2. So I'd recommend, while you've got the chance, grab it on the Crew 2. Even though this could come as a monthly event car, it's better to get it early than to get it to hope that it comes, because we don't know what's coming as a monthly cars. But there's a possibility it could, but I wouldn't take that chance, I'd just stick to this and get it because this will be an unperishable car because it's a summit vehicle so they don't really sell summit cars otherwise you're just hoping that it comes back another time but I'd recommend getting on it today if you can or whenever you're free but make sure you get on it way before Wednesday because you want to get it before Wednesday because it goes on Wednesday so that's all there is to it is what I want to say for this video but now we're just gonna have a go at the car because it feels nice to drive and the crew too that is it's it's just one of them it's a comfortable car and i missed out on it when it first came out which was unfortunate for me but it's now back so i'm getting my hands on it now while i've got the chance now as you can see i already ran this event and we're only here now to try and beat our time but there's a possibility that that won't happen because i'm clearly not driving as good as i can and when i'm talking I do drive a little bit worse sometimes. You're best off saving your nitrous. Well, I don't use my nitrous correctly half the time. But this is, like I said, this is a very, lo very long event. But we're doing it because it's content and you get to see what you have to do. You only have to stick on this event for a fair bit. But, you know, you've got to do all the events anyway to unlock it. So it's, it's worth your time to get it done and as you can see if you want to keep beating your record you're gonna get you're gonna see if you're winning it by just playing the race because you'll see if you passed yourself which is a, one of the pluses of doing the having these sort of time trial events but I mean yeah it's a, it's an interesting interesting car and it's obviously a new summit vehicle that was previously in the game so it's not as, it's not new as such but it's new to people that don't have it already so it's worth getting on picking up this car while you've got the chance and yeah you would just enjoy the car for what it is but I missed out on it beforehand because I don't know I just it was obviously back then everyone was playing the crew as well so made it harder to get it but now they've now it's it's fairly simple because a lot less people are playing the game and if nobody's making videos like me, which some of the top creators are not making these videos to tell people to come back, then people end up missing out because they haven't been informed. So I'm just doing my part for the YouTube community and for the crew community in just showing you that you can go onto the crew too now and get it because some of you might have deleted it already, 
but this car might be worth you re-downloading it. Getting on, just getting this car because it's nice to have, you know, the cruise version of a police car in the game, especially if you're someone that likes Fords, or even if you don't like Fords and you just like the Ford GT, then it's worth picking up. But you can make that judgement yourself, but make sure you get it done. I'd say get it done before Tuesday the latest, because you don't want to you don't want to leave it till Wednesday, because for me, it changes at Wednesday around 4 in the morning, just like 4 a.m. So, unless you're going to be up at like 4 in the morning UK time, I wouldn't. I wouldn't recommend waiting. I'd get it done. I'd get it done way before Tuesday, but I'd get it done before definitely before Wednesday because it goes on Wednesday. But yeah, this is just me giving you your heads up. So get on to the crew too. Gives you a reason to play the game, and then you know, get this car for motor to play on Motorfest. Is what you should be doing. I might do another video of this on the Motorfest, I don't think I will though. But I'm, I'm, I'll, I'll, I'll test it on my own time anyway, to give it a go, see if I like it on Motorfest. Which you will unlock it on the Motorfest after you've unlocked it on the crew. It might not be straight away, you might have to give it an hour, and then you'll get it. But it's worth doing. And we'll see, and come back for next week, because next week there's some tyres. I've already got the tyres, but they do transfer over to Motorfest, so I'll do a little video on that so you can see the tyres, and I did do a video on it beforehand, so these tyres have been around before, and I have got a video on the channel, but I will be covering that. So there's that. But yeah, it's cool. If you've already got this car then, you know. Leave a, leave a comment on below saying I've got it or something. I don't know. Just give me the, I'd like to know who's got like the stuff as well. So it's like it's it's cool to know. Cause you might be one of these players that go, you know, played the crew when I was when I was recording it. You might be one of the OG people on my channel, but I don't know, because a lot of you don't comment, which is fine. But it is nice to see comments so I get recommendations and like what my video is doing and if you like the video, I guess. But yeah, as we're coming up to the finish line, you know, hopefully you all that participated in it, hopefully you've all got the right parts so you can get 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 the car. But yeah, I've, I'm clearly going to unlock it. So hopefully you, the, you lot will too. So here we go, across the line. And there we go, 6 minutes 43. Bit of a longer video because it's a longer race, but that's just me showing you right here the police car. So that is it for the video. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a like and subscribe, and hopefully I'll see you in the next video.